Today I'll show you how to disroute the MSI Ventus 5080. It's really easy on this card, it's held up by this post to the back plate. So all you need to do is just take out a few screws, these five, and these two at the end, and that's enough to get the shroud off. Unfortunately the back plate doesn't have any heat pads, so it's not cooling the PCB from the back. The heatsink is fully flat, which is great, you can just put fans right on top of it. Don't forget to disconnect the fan cables before taking the shroud off. This took me 10 minutes to disconnect, this was a pain. Yeah, deshrouding the Ventus was really worth it. So even at the full TDP of 360, the temps are barely 70. While they were reaching 82 with the stock cooler. And the fans are spinning it at, at the full speed, but it's barely audible with these noxious. I can definitely make them go even quieter. While well, maybe getting 75 degrees, which is still really, really good. And the thing is, these fans are bigger than the heatsink, so a little bit of the air is going through. But that's, even that's enough, even that's enough to cool this thing. This is really, really good. Yeah, that finished. This is really good. And uh, the overclock right now, it's 400 on the core, 1600 on the memory. The full power limit, that's just so good, so good.